On the last episode, I built an insane XP farm. Uh, yeah. So today I went to the nether and built myself a blaze farm. Welcome to episode three and I hope you guys enjoy. I have some friendly visitors taking a nice little swim, maybe some backstrokes in my lake right here. Can you guys guess who? <laughs> What are they doing? They're literally swimming across this entire lake. I saw them run from this mountain down this little trench into the water, and they're just literally backstroking away. Is there something over there that they want to see? Like, are they trying to enter the butt crack? Let me warn you, it doesn't smell good. <laughs> I just realized there were four of them. I, I guess two of them drowned. That's kind of unfortunate. Well, hopefully these two guys make it. You know what? Let's document this. Let's grab a boat. Yeah. yeah. Oh, there you are. You got, uh, you got left out from the crowd, huh? I could save you right here. Get in my boat. Let me back up. Beep, beep, beep. Hop in. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's go. I'll bring you back to your boys. All right. Let me just skirt. Let me uh, break this boat. And let's get out of here before I die. Man, we, we are good civilians. Look at them. I just reunited their family. Oh, there they go. Leaving his family. <laughs> Leaving his son behind again. <laughs> well, that was quite interesting. But anyways, last episode, I tried building a mob spawner or a XP farm over here. And it really wasn't successful at all. Like, it, it gave me one creeper and maybe two skeletons tops. So that's all it gave me. So, yeah, I think I'm going to be tearing this down or trying to fix it at least. Because my main goal is to get some more XP to get some OP armor. And luckily, last episode, we found the most OP, insane hog champ nether spot in history. Oh, whoops. I forgot I had a green screen texture pack on. <laughs> That's better. But yeah, we spawned right beside two giant bastions and a fortress right over there. Oh my god, I always forget to wear gold coming to the nether. But the craziest part is that isn't only the fortress nearby me. There's also one over there in that direction, but there is an abandoned nether portal right here uh, with nothing good. I'll take the golden apple, I guess. Ooh, a mending golden pickaxe. I probably never use that. Yoink. Oh my god. Oh my god. I was not expecting all that. Okay. Um, nice to meet you guys too. I literally saw like four. I mean, there's only three here, but there was one over there. Hey, maybe this is good luck. Maybe I'll get a wither skeleton skull. And nothing. Wow. But the main reason why I'm here. Oh, there you are. Hiding in the shadows. Ugh. Please go away. But yeah, the main reason why I'm here is because the XP farm I made in the oh my in the overworld was pretty bad. It didn't give me any mobs. So there is a blaze spawner I found over here. And this episode, I want to turn that into a actual grinder so I can get some XP. If only I could get there without being bothered by a, a million different types of mobs. Oh my speaking of mobs. Ah, ooh, a bow. Oh my god. That is the highest durability bow I've ever gotten from a skeleton. Uh, there it is, guarded by two giant wither skeletons. Just give me your head and we could just uh, move on about our day nope hello sir nope double nope but let's gather all the materials i need to turn this into a grinder and soon we're gonna have a whole bunch of xp and maybe some op armor finally all right i need a lot of stone for this project i could destroy the xp farm i made last episode but i already built it so might as well just collect some more stone and let's do it over here somewhere i feel bad destroying the earth but uh let's call this area the destruction zone maybe i could drain out this entire lake and turn it into like a toxic zone shout out to scavio for the insane video but let's start the pain again of collecting resources interesting three endermen right in front of me there's no choice i have to do this i have to do this go 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 yeah i know endermen do a lot of damage okay what 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 Oh. Okay, leave me alone, please. Let me deal with these endermen. Where are all these things coming from? <laughs> okay, let me eat. Let me eat any heal. I'm actually scared of dying. Okay, let's kill this guy. Just farm him real quick. Idiot. <laughs> Jumped into the water. What are you doing? The guy really wants to hit me. Um, Got one. Yes, I got the pearl. Oh, he got it. He got it. Give me that back. You thief. There should be two more. This guy just forgot about me. Okay, never mind. I looked at him. Uh, oh my god. Okay, I really need to go. I really need to go here. Oh my god. I'm going home. And let's go to bed. Oh, come on, man.
All right, I finally completed smelting off this stone, which took a pretty long time. But now let's turn it into stone bricks. And everybody was telling me to use stone cutters because they'll give me more stone bricks. But I swear it gives me the same. I, I don't know. I'm not a Minecraft enthusiast, but uh, let's try it out. Now, how do we make a stone cutter? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh. That's it. All right, if you say so. Okay, for some reason, it's not working. I did the recipe and it's not giving me a stone cutter. Am I doing this wrong? Hello? Ah, just kidding. You guys really thought I was gonna be that dumb? Oh. All right, but let's slap it down right here and snatch all this. All right, let's see what the hype is about. Let's see what all you guys are talking about because you guys were saying it gives me more. It gives me the same. Why is everybody saying it gives me more? Hello? I don't get it. Am I just being dumb, guys? Because it just gives me one-to-one -one ratio. It would do the same thing if it did this. Look at that. Maybe it's the stairs that does it. This gives me four or six pieces. And this, ah, uh, okay. So it's better for the slab stairs and walls, I'm guessing. All right, I got you guys. Let's grab have some vines here because i think this will prevent the blazes from flying up also did it even mention i'm building a blaze farm i do not remember at all it's been two full days since i recorded my last clip so uh i'm kind of lost here <laughs> i think i'm building a blaze farm i don't know i could be going to the end to kill the ender dragon i don't really remember but let's just uh go to the nether <laughs> all right back here with the most insane nether spawn ever it still blows my mind snipe oh okay i also really need to build a actual bridge going there because this is kind of scary especially with all the gas and skeleton spawning here i'm here to farm your family don't mind me Ugh. let's kill all these blazes in the way all right i already have a small section mined out here from last time but let's go seven blocks down one two three four five six seven i think if i know how to count one four five six seven all right nice i passed the first grade surprisingly oh please go away i'm trying to farm you guys like it's a barn come on let's just go underneath here and it should be a 13 by 13 area let's start carving Oh my blazes. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's a little more than I expected here. Let's make a quick little a safety path out just in case I get too swarmed. Okay, I'm already being swarmed. They already blocked my entrance. These guys are one step ahead of the game. They're blocking my entrance out. Oh my god, they're even in my hiding spot. Oh my god, they're everywhere. I don't even know this many could spawn. I'm trying to hit these guys with my feet too. You guys know what I mean. I put a keyboard on my foot so I could uh, left click with it. And it's kind of interesting. It's, it's kind of fun. Okay, I'm, I, get, I get so distracted. All right, let's kill all these blazes. I think it will help if I break this spawner, right? It should stop the spawning. Ah, uh, just kidding. All right, let's continue building this thing so I can get out of here alive because this is getting a little out of hand. Oh my god. Oh! I'm gonna pop a vein in my forehead. This is getting so annoying. Oh my god. This is actually suffer. Oh, okay. Stop, stop, stop. This is getting out of hand. Stop, bro. Hello there. Um, please go away. Oh my god. Oh, oh, I'm being farmed. This is not fun. If you guys want to experience true pain, put yourself a blade spawner in Minecraft and you, you'll feel it. I'm sorry for sandwich. I'm eating a lollipop. <laughs> All right, now let's fill in the rooftop. All right, there we go. And now for the super challenge. Oh, it's a wall of blazes. <laughs> Forget the wall of leaves. Wall of blazes. <laughs> Okay, well, now I gotta fill in these walls, which is gonna be really annoying. Try my best, though. Oh, you, you guys better. You guys better stop. Because I'm gonna farm you guys once this is done. And you guys are gonna regret shooting me with all your balls. You guys are about to feel it when I get this finished. Unless I die right here, which is a really high possibility. Oh, man. Some fire resistance right now would be uh, amazing. But unfortunately, I do not have the facilities for that. I don't think you have the facilities for that, big man. Oh, my. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's getting a little too close here sometimes. Okay, I'm almost done here. I got most of it complete. I just need the top section right up there. So let's get up there. And this one won't be too bad. I could just like hug this wall and I should be fine. I'm really hoping I built this right because if I didn't, I'm going to be really upset. Like uh, it's gonna, I'm going to be so mad if I have to go back in there and fight all these blazes and fix something up. That's going to be actual pain. So let's pray I'm building this correctly here. Why did they hit me? I literally have my shield up. Okay, I think I'm pretty much done. I just need to clean up the inside and I should have... <gasps> I broke my pickaxe. Are you kidding? Oh no, I wasn't paying attention. I broke all of me. I'm gonna throw a tantrum like a five-year-old. I got mine. This is my fist. How embarrassing. You guys saw nothing. I totally didn't break my pickaxe. 
Wow, I really broke my pickaxe. That's <laughs> that's embarrassing. Let's craft another pickaxe. Oh, <laughs> that's not sticks. Okay, there we go. And let's enchant. Yes, efficiency four. Oh, yes. Fortune. It was destined for me to break the pickaxe. See, guys, that was all calculated. Like, I, I saw that coming. I, just, I could see the future. I knew I was going to get fortune. So I told myself to break that pickaxe. I just need to go... Uh, grab some lava and bam, bam oh and let's continue working there's no more blazes we gotta go quick come on come on this is the only time this is the only time i can get with no blazes break all this hurry 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 please hurry mine faster mine faster go 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 mine faster why does this take so long no no come on I'm almost done. Clean all this garbage up. Oh, no. Yeah, I think I need to mine that. I'm not sure if I need to put anything up there. Okay, that's it. Let's break it. Okay, we're all clean. Let's slap down another bricks in the middle. And I think the lava buckets go over here. I'm not sure yet, but let's just go. And it should... Okay, it stops right there. And let's leave and grab some more lava. Yeah. That was not a bucket. Grab this. And there's one right over here. Nice. All right. Right back in we go. Let's make a quick staircase. Oh, what? There's a hole right here. Lava. Lava. And I'm out. Oh, man, I was not supposed to do that. Oh, did my armor break too? Something broke. I heard something break. And my helmet broke. I, I, I'm not, uh, I just hit a nerve. I'm literally not paying attention to anything. My helmet popped. At least we're done, I think. All we got to do is make the grinder part right down here. And we should be good. Let's make a little area here. And I forgot to bring slabs, bro. I, I didn't even bring a crafting table. Oh, my. And we're back. I got a bunch of materials and I can design the inside of this now. Make it look super pretty or it could look really ugly. It could <laughs> either or. So let's put some trap doors here so the blazes can't touch me. Because you can't touch this. You know, I'm just uh, untouchable. And bam, bam. And I think I'm supposed to put some vines here. So let's do that right here so they can't fly up. I'm kind of scared to break. Oh, bro. That's all my vines I have. Oh, let's change this up into... What should I change it to? Maybe barrels? Something super random yeah i kind of I kinda like that let's get these corners into some logs oh yeah and now for the rest all right i got the inside all designed and i'm really hoping the blazes can't shoot through these gaps or else uh we might have a problem here with all this wood so let's pray and i'm pretty sure my nether portal is over here somewhere over in the north side so if i mind straight i should make a quick entrance into my blaze farm if my mathematical calculations are correct a few moments later oh my god how long is this am i even going the right way i feel like i'm not how's this still going one eternity later oh i hit so sand and all right we're out wonder where we are you might not even be in the correct area oh we're right beside our bridge nice and I'm actually going to fill up all of this with slabs to prevent these mobs from spawning so all the blazes can spawn in the grinder And let's continue the same design right here along these entire walls. All right, well, I got the area all carved out for the walls and the ceiling. But before I do that, I really want to test out to see if this will even work. So I'm going to break this. And it's the moment of truth now. I really need to reset these vines, though. But hopefully, the remaining vines will prevent them from flying up. And they won't be able to shoot their flames and fireballs through this gap. Well, let's give it a test. It doesn't look like they're flying up. I mean, that's a good sign. And they're not shooting their fireballs. Let's go. All right, not too bad. I think it's working. Are you guys going to shoot me? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, they can shoot, they can shoot. Maybe I shouldn't look them in the eye. But since it's working, I'm gonna head back to the overworld and grab a whole bunch of resources to build the walls and the ceiling. I didn't record it, but this gas broke my nether portal when I was going in it. Oh, what do I do now? Okay, there is fire here. I did learn a trick from my comments. If I put wood right here, I think, it might light up the portal if the fire transfers over to it. Please leave me alone. Gas causes me so much stress, I swear. Okay, let's just sit here and pray the fire transfers. There is a bunch of fire here, so it's should eventually oh nice it worked i'm out of here i actually got kind of scared that would be stuck in the nether but now it's time for Yeet. oh my <laughs> 
Oh, I really missed. I thought about that clip for five minutes too, and I just biffed it. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, that was a close one. Hey, at least I got a grass block, though, without so touch ever. That was pretty risky, but it wasn't worth it at all. Let's head back now and start working on that hallway. And I totally forgot to make myself a helmet, bruh. Oh my, I broke my ass, bro. You kidding me? Yeah. And there we go. I finished the hallway into my blaze farm. I wish I added another layer of slabs right here so I can actually double jump and move a lot faster, but I kind of messed up the design. All good though. It looks pretty fancy and the blaze spawner seems to work quite well. I haven't really used it too much yet, but before I get some XP and get OP armor, I do want to build a bridge from here connecting all the way to my nether portal over there somewhere. That. Oh my God. That just came lurking out the freaking shadows. Watch, I'm going to jump kill him. Yeah! Oh, I didn't kill him. Oh, there's two. There's two. Oh, I'm low. I'm low. I'm low. Go, 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 go. Oh, did he blow anything up? I don't think he did. How did it not kill him? If you put that in slow-mo, I would look so sick. That would be like a James Bond movie. But I should probably make a bow sometime soon. Ah, there we go. In order for me to build this bridge and pathway over to the blaze farm from another portal, I'm going to need a lot of resources. So let's go back into the jungle and collect a whole bunch of wood and probably some stone brick or something. Ah, wish me luck. I'm probably going to stick with this dark oak wood just because it's so easy to get. It's like abundant and it looks way better than jungle wood. So let's yoink all this from the earth. All right, I got a whole bunch of dark oak logs now. That should be enough, I'm hoping. And for the spruce wood, luckily, I can just do this. And what the? What, what just that? Oh, oh, <laughs> what the? I, was, uh, I thought I was cheating for a second. I could just do this and let's gather a whole bunch of spruce logs now. And probably every other type of logs that exist in Minecraft. Wait, actually, it's probably not a good idea to build this bridge out of wood in the nether. Now that I think of it, um, I think I just wasted like half an hour of my time. But I'm already this far, so might as well keep collecting logs, I guess. And I think I made the savanna even uglier. Like, look at... <laughs> Oh, that's not much better. It's just an even darker color of the poo. But let, let's just forget about it. I have my logs. That's what's important. And now for more cobblestone. I, oh, I should really get silk touch. It'll make my life so much easier. Okay, let's actually do that. Let's try to get silk touch. So I don't need to smell all that cobblestone. Yeet. Let's head over to the nether. Head into my uh, beautiful tunnel over here. And now let's finally put this to use and grab some XP. All right, with 37 levels, hopefully that should be enough to get Silk Touch. Let's make that and please... Oh, I need some... Grab that and please... First try, come on, come on. Oh, fortune again. I'm breaking. Ah, oh, okay, I have one more try. Please, please give me Silk Touch. Oh, dang it, bro. There we go. Silk touch efficiency four. There's no one breaking, but I'll take it. Silk touch. Let's go. All right. Let's mine some stone. I'm going to need a lot of this stuff. And while I mine for some stone, let's add some people to the wall of leaves. Congratulations to Gummy on YouTube and Janik on Twitter. Thank you guys for the support. And right back to the video. Got all of my stuff ready and before we go i need to get some more food and i finally realized something is about to break so i need to replace some of my armor i've been uh, pretty distracted and i think i'm running low on diamonds so should i go mining for diamonds for some protection and some armor or should i get some food that is the question what is more important here 
Ah, uh -huh. you guys already knew the answer. On Joshua's side, though, I really do need some new boots. So let's just repair this. I have no choice. There we go. And there we go. I'm running low on resources. I'm going to have to go mining again soon, especially with Fortune 3. It'll make my life a lot easier. But let's finish up this bridge in the nether. And this bridge is going to stretch across this entire nether from my nether portal all the way to my blaze spawner, which is a pretty far distance. And I probably shouldn't use a lot of wood or the entire thing would just burn down. So let's see what I can come up with. Like I said, let's avoid wood. <laughs> oh, I think this will last a maximum of maybe three episodes. And this entire thing will be gone. It would just be a floating stone brick pathway. Oh, who builds with wood in the nether? Like, it's such a bad idea. Like, come on. <laughs> All right, now that the first bridge is complete, let's start working on the even bigger bridge that will cross this entire area all the way over there somewhere. And this one's going to be a pain. So let's craft a bunch of slabs. And it's not going to be a three block thick bridge i think because it's gonna take way too many materials let me just make room for this fat bridge to cross across the entire nether and let's build this diagonally all the way over there till that little stone brick block right over there oh no i have a visitor <laughs> Please let me be. Hey, let me just keep building. Let me keep building here. Don't mind me. Just building a simple little bridge. There he goes. I'm surprised you listen. What a nice guy. Oh my god, I lied. Why is there so many now? <laughs> I finally managed to connect the two together all the way to my blaze farm. And I could leave it like this, but like, that's really boring. So let's decorate it up. And you know what I should add? Some wood, which is probably not the best idea. Let's put them like this. Would this be enough space to run across? Um, a little tight. <laughs> Please subscribe. And I'm going to slap some slabs on top of the logs so no more mobs can spawn and try to kill me. And there we go. I got an epic pathway that leads me all the way to my blaze farm and to my portal across this giant lava lake. I was going to add some pillars that go all the way down, but the lava would just burn it all the way back up. So I don't really want to risk it. And eventually this whole thing is probably going to burn down from somebody like that. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Oh, no. Bro. No. <laughs> oh, why? It hasn't even lasted a minute yet. Leave me alone, bro. I just run away from those bad men. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and see you later. Uh, uh.